No score in the top of the first, but an early chance for the Gary Salisher Railcats, who are trying to win a third game in a row after dropping six of seven. Breaking ball lifted high in the air to left field. Pretty deep. Back goes Ebert. Back towards the winding track. Back near the corner. And it's off the wall in play. A fair ball around third. Crosby will score. DeJesus right behind him. DeJesus scores without a relay. A two-run double off the wall down the line and left for Randy Sandy Esteban. And the Railcats jump out to an early 2-0 lead. Here's the 1-0 pitch. Breaking ball lifted in the air to center and deep. Drifting back, Abercrombie got turned around. Reggie makes the catch in front of the warning track. Sandy Esteban tags will come in to score. And the Railcats have a 3 to nothing lead. Alfredo Jimenez, who tonight is playing in his 500th career professional game. It's a sacrifice fly to deep center. Good situational hitting by Jimenez. And the Railcats have a 3 nothing advantage. Now the 0-2, swing a ground ball, hit to the right side. Moving forward, Nathan C. Fields, quick throw to first, and it gets away from McAdams, and it goes into the Railcats' dugout. Fabio around third will score. Crosby awarded second base. And it's 4-0 Railcats in the top half of the second. Right-hander to left-hander, the 2-2 pitch. Little looper the other way, tough play. It's over the reach of Sandy Esteban, a piece hit down the left field line. McAdams scores. Tyler Baker with a two-out single the other way, drives home Josh McAdams, and the goal eyes are on the board at 4-1 to one in the bottom half of the second. Nice piece of fitting by Tyler Baker. He fights off a tough pitch in the hands. Here's the 0-2 pitch. Ground ball the other way. Fair ball past the dive of Crosby and into the Railcats bullpen. Baker on his way to third. He'll be waved to the plate by Rick Forney. Carry up with the ball. This throw gets away from Crosby. Baker scores standing up. And on to third goes Jordan Ebert with an RBI triple down the right field line. And it's now 4-2 Railcats in the bottom half of the second. Jordan Ebert on nothing in two, pokes one just beyond the reach of Alex Crosby. It bounced there over the bag and into the Railcats bullpen. That was a tough ball for Dale Carey to dig out of the corner. And Baker scores all the way from first. Jordan Ebert triples for a second time in three games. Minor from the stretch. Abercrombie drives it towards the gap in left center field. Racing over Wilson. Won't get there. It's down for a base hit. Head rolling all the way to the wall. Matt McCann rounds third. On his way to the plate. The relay by DeJesus. Not in time. McCann slides in safe with that attack. Reggie Abercrombie with a double and a run batted into left center. It's now 4-3 to three Railcats. And the tying run is on second with nobody out. Reggie Abercrombie drives into the first pitch all the way to the left center field wall, and Matt McCann scores from first. So Abercrombie with his second hit of tonight's ball game. The one-two pitch. Ground ball towards the middle. Off the glove of Fabio and rolls behind him. Abercrombie will score, and McAdams is safe at first. It's 4-4 four to four in the bottom half of the third. The 0 1 chopper up the middle, tough play. It's going to be grabbed by McCann, steps on second, fires to first, and it's in time for the double play. Nicely done by Matt McCann. A high chopper, McCann, and a wait for it to come down. He gloved it right over the back, stepped on second, a force out Fabio, and at just enough time to finish the double play. 2 2. Ground ball off McGovern's body. It ricochets to first. McGovern flips to first. It's just in time to get Jimenez in to score Sandy Esteban. The Railcats take a 5 4 lead, but now concerned for Kevin McGovern, who was struck in the lower half. I'm not sure if it caught him in the upper part of his leg or the lower part, or maybe in the foot, but McGovern in some significant pain right now behind the mound. The 2 2 pitch. Swinging a bouncer to the right side. Runner coming to the plate. Nathan's has it. Fires home. Baker's tag and plenty of time to get Willis. And there's two men down in the fifth. The first pitch. Line drive. Shallow left field. It's down for a base hit. Carey scores. Wilson on to second. A two-out RBI single to left for Tillman Pugh. And the Railcats extend the lead to 6-4. The 0-2. Hit in the air to center, see if it's deep enough. Wilson backs up a step, makes the catch. Romanski tags, coming to the plate. Throw goes in a second. Romanski scores standing up. Josh Mazzola with a sacrifice, flying a run batted into center field. It's now six to five Railcats in the bottom of the fifth. And Josh Mazzola has just taken sole possession of second place on the American Association's all-time RBI list. 
See if Daniel Miner goes out for the sixth. He's at 108 pitches over five. Ground ball to the right side. Long range for Nathans. He's got it. Spins, fires to first. And it's in time to get Crosby for the first out. Amazing play by Tucker Nathans. He had a sprint hard onto the shallow part of the right field grass. Stabbed the ball, rolled over, and almost in one motion fires a strike to Josh McAdams. So Crosby flat out robbed of the base hit. Andy DeJesus will step in and he'll bat left-handed for the first time tonight. He is 0 for 3. Johnson ready in the 2-2 pitch. Line drive to left. That'll get down for a base hit. DeJesus into third. They're going to wave him around. DeJesus scores. A two-out RBI single to left for Colin Willis. And the Railcats stretch the lead to 7-5. And the first pitch to carry. Ground ball to the left side. Mazzola's got it. Goes to second for one. Nathan's on to first. Double play. And the inning is over. Josh Mazzola starts a 5-4-3 double play. That's the fourth ground ball double play in this series for the Gold Eyes defense. 2-2 pitch. Driving the air towards right field. Racing over Romanski towards the corner. That'll drop in fair for a base and it bounce off the wall. Jimenez around third. He'll score. And Tillman Pugh goes to second with an RBI double. The Railcats now lead 8-5 to five in the top half of the ninth. Payoff pitch. Line drive towards right center. That's down for a base hit. Tillman Pugh into third. He'll be waved to the plate. Pugh's going to score. Throw goes into second. And sliding in safe ahead of McCann's tag. Cole Fabio with an RBI double. Uh, another 0-2 pitch. Swing and a miss. He got him. And the ball game is over. Miles Smith strikes out Matt McCann and converts a six-out save as the Gary South Shore Railcats defeat the Winnipeg Gold Eyes by a final score of 9-5 to five in the middle game of a three-game series. So the Railcats have taken the first two from Winnipeg here at Shaw Park. The Gold Eyes will try and pull out the finale tomorrow afternoon.